places to make sure that the child and the dog is safe at all times. We've got Ali in the chair. Who's the child? Okay, so the child who's got a physical disability. And then we've got Tolly, her lovely golden retriever assistance dog there. You can see the task work is very similar. The retrieve is all the same, but it will be tailored to, I don't know, mobile phones, Game Boys, all the sort of gimmicks and gadgets that kids have for today. God, I sound old. Anyway, so the tree is exactly the same, but this means that mum and dad can be downstairs doing stuff, and the child can be upstairs, they can start to develop some independence and not rely on mum and dad to pick up the mobile phone if they drop it. They've got their best friend next to them who's going to retrieve that for them. They've got their best friend who's going to pull open the, the bedside drawer, who's then going to retrieve their gloves for them or their clothing for them. They haven't got a shout for mum and dad to come and get that for them. So at a young age, we can really start to give our children independence, start to help them develop their social manners. They've got a dog that will help them get undressed, remove gloves, jackets, remove socks. It really means that they can get on with life without having to rely on their assistance without their having to rely on their, their mum and dad. Retrieve the phone off the table. Drops it, hands it to, to Ali's hand there nice and gently. Where are we going now? Over to the bin. And this is very useful. A very tidy child. I know it's a rarity, but with assistance dog, that's fine because the dog will go and take the rubbish, will pop it in the bin, shut the bin, and there we are. We have a very tidy child there. No problem there. So you can see the task work is slightly different, but it really means the key is that it allows the child to start to develop independence and be able to experience life without having to rely on mum and dad. Go on, you can, I know they're a bit smelly. Go on, Tolly, you can pull those. Go on. They're a bit sweaty, are they? <laughs> yeah, there's one song. Bless her. You can see throughout, she's thoroughly enjoying what she's doing, the tail's wagging, and this is the key to all of our training. And there we are, we've got the, that's it, and a yucky plaster as well. We don't want her to retrieve that plaster. But you can see, this is our second service. So this is training dogs to work with young children. So give these guys a round of applause.